Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name's Jade and I do things all beauty and makeup related. If that sounds good to you then why not hit that subscribe button. Today I have a really exciting one because we will be going through what I bought in the Beauty Bay Black Friday sale along with two palettes that I purchased in the Be Perfect £10 palette sale. If you'd like to see what I got please keep on watching. <laughs> So first of all, I'm going to start with the Be Perfect Cosmetic palettes that I picked up. There was two palettes, one of them I kept going back to when they did the ninth birthday sale and the other one I have been waiting for it to go on sale and I never thought it would. Um, so the first palette that I picked up was the Be Perfect Jack Jossa Gold Glow Goddess palette. Now this palette looks stunning, it's a perfect neutral palette, lots of shimmers, really really gorgeous and I'm so happy that I finally got round to picking it up. So this is the Jack Jossa Glow Goddess palette, I love the quality of their palettes, they're really like not too heavy but you can definitely feel the quality in them. This has 12 shades inside and a big mirror, this is what the palette looks like inside really really beautiful you have lots of it's basically a neutral palette but there's lots of shimmers in there i love the fact you've got light tones dark tones and it's just gorgeous you can see it's not as dark as it does seem this bit is reflective so it is picking up most of the light but you do have this purple here this orange this kind of reddish tone these two shimmers here, so you have a pink and a gold one, but you also have your light browns and your dark browns, and I just think it's stunning. The other palette that I picked up, um, this is the one that I have been waiting for, is this one. It is the Sensorium Chapter 1, and I do believe this is in collaboration with Alexis Stone. This palette is gorgeous. So this is the packaging, it is reflective. This is what the back of the palette looks like. I hold it at this angle just so the light doesn't beam off of it. This is what the palette looks like and I'm in love. So many different shades, so many different shimmers and it's just gorgeous. The fact that this palette went from £40, I'll put the price on the screen, to £10, I had to grab it. I had to, I had to grab it. I was waiting and waiting, like I said, they had the nine, £9 birthday palette sales and this one wasn't included. So when I saw that this was included in the £10 palette sales, I thought it was a mistake and I jumped on it. Um, it's just gorgeous, so many different shades and I just can't wait to see the quality of this palette because this is one of their most expensive palettes. So those were the palettes that I picked up in the Be Perfect palette sale, but now we will be moving on to what I picked up from Beauty Bay. I'm going to start off with the skincare products that I picked up and then we will move into the makeup. So the first thing that I did pick up was this CeraVe SA Smoothing Cleanser. I absolutely love their products. I have one of their products which is a smoothing moisturiser so after you get out of the shower if you have like rough arms not as in dry but sort of like textured arms it's so good after a shower to just lather yourself up in it so I wanted to pick this up um, now this is for dry rough bumpy skin gently cleanse whilst exfoliating your skin without disrupting the protective skin barrier with three essential ceramides, salicylic acid and hyaluronic acid, fragrance free. Now this, I don't use every day. I will use it if I feel my skin is a bit textured. I do find it does leave my skin dry. So once I've used it, I do use a lot of moisturizer on my face, but it has made my skin texture improve on my face. Um, so yeah, I'm really happy that I picked this up. The next product that I picked up was, oh, <laughs> this pack of um, blemish stickers. Now I've wanted to try these so long, but I haven't known which brand to reach for. These are what the stickers look like. So you have your different sizes. There is two packets. Um, this is the other packet here. 
but yes they are so good literally you cleanse your face and everything make sure your face is dry and then you just pop them onto your spot um, and it does not move it is so sticky it will stay on overnight you can even use them during the day and you're not really you can't really notice them on your face they are really really good um, It's a fluid absorbing gel that draws out pus and other impurities from your pimples. I really like them and I just feel they work so well for my skin. So I'm really happy that I picked these up. The next thing that I picked up was this Revolution Pro Lip Balm. Um, this is for day and night and I really love this. I've been using it every night before I go to bed. Um, with hyaluronic acid, vitamins B5, C and E. It is amazing. Um, this is what it looks like. So it comes in this gold lid, glass, frosted tinted bottle. And it is called Restore. This is what it looks like. And it's just so soft and gorgeous. I really, really love it. I'm just putting it on so you can see what it looks like. But yeah, it's your lips are so soft. I really, really am happy I got this. Um, so yeah, that was one thing that I picked up which I've been loving and I do recommend it. The next thing I picked up was this Revolution Skincare Purifying Charcoal Peel Off Mask absolutely love it again it's a pore cleansing one and i've used this once i don't like to use peel off masks every day so i'll use this once a week um especially around the t-zone area and honestly this is just as good as my garnier one when you put it on don't put a thick layer and within 15 minutes you just peel it off and it came off in one i was really really happy so this i definitely recommend i really enjoyed using it and did notice a difference so the next products that i want to share with you that i purchased in the haul are face products um so let's get into it so the first product that i picked up was this xx revolution blush tint i do believe these are fairly new this is in the shade rosy this is what the bottle looks like and it does look really really pigmented um it's a screw top and i will show you what it looks like so this is what the shade rosy looks like really really gorgeous i'm just gonna pat it out so this is it patted out and now i'm going to blend it so that is the shade rosy it does have quite a wet finish but that is a gorgeous gorgeous shade so i can't wait to see how that applies on a base the next product i picked up was a super matte powder this is in the shade beige and i have hit pan on so many of these so i just had to pick one up the last product that i picked up for face makeup was the revolution cosmetic tape I was really interested in trying this. I haven't opened it yet, but um, I just wanted to see if it was worth the vibe. Um, you know, see if it helps for like quick looks and stuff. So let's open it and see what it looks like. So this is the product. It is literally just the tape. I am gonna give this a go and see if it's any good. Um, but yeah, I think this was as, as cheap as two pound i will put the price on the screen of all the products now the last products that i ordered had to be eyeshadow palettes i am a sucker for eyeshadow palettes um so let's get into it the first palette that i picked up was the golden age palette this is so stunning in person because i've had the age of opulence one i have to pick this up um she is gorgeous this is the packaging just the basic standard beauty bay and this is what she looks like inside so you have your mirror on the top and this is the palette three different tones of gold you have this rosy bronzy gold here actually you have four golds 
two browns, a light brown, it's just stunning. So again, just to give you a better look of the palette, this is what the palette looks like. And I feel this palette would be perfect for travel um, and I can't wait to try it. So as I just mentioned, I did have the Age of Opulence palette. There is a previous YouTube video of me doing a tutorial on some swatches, but because it went on sale and I did give the palette away, I had to pick it up because Beauty Bay has a soft slot in my heart. This is the Age of Opulence palette. You have all seen this before, but I had to pick it up. Um, I need it in my collection. So I will show you what the palette looks like again absolutely stunning this is the palette again you have your blues your purples lots of rich tones in here and it is a beautiful palette so the next palette i picked up i have been wanting for so long and that is the xx revolution mv palette this palette is perfect for christmas i feel the colors in here are gorgeous greens reds browns it i've just it's stunning i'm so glad i picked it up this is what the palette looks like inside and as you can see i feel it's very christmassy it's just gorgeous i absolutely love xx revolution formulas this green here is christmas all over um i would have loved a red glitter to go with it but you do have different greens you have your reds you have your purples you have your blues and i just had to get it when i saw it go on sale the next palette that i picked up i couldn't resist and that is because of the color story it is the xx revolution turkey palette this is the big one the color story i'm in love with the packaging not so much so this is what the palette looks like it is a turkey um not too keen on it but the color story inside is beautiful so what I love about this palette is that it does collapse. You do have your mirror on one side and this is what the turkey palette looks like. It is gorgeous. Lots of warm tones, fiery tones, browns, reds, oranges. She is stunning and I can't wait to see the quality of this palette. I do feel a bit weird holding up a turkey but this colour story is gorgeous. Now, the last palette I have in this collection is the Jade palette. Beauty Bay, as I mentioned, I absolutely love their formulas and I wasn't going to get this because I feel when I open it up and show you, you have the four separate parts of the palette which do look very similar to the Wilderness, um, Romantic palette, the Book of Magic and the Sunset Horizon palette. but. This is gorgeous. So this is the packaging for the palette. Really, really stunning. I love the vibe. I love the colors. Really, really nice. Really, really stunning. Now this palette, I can see so much potential with. You have your pinks, your purples here, and then you have your blues, your greens, your browns, your cool tones here. So you could have two separate parts of this palette, holding it this way i do feel you could have your different seasons in here so example spring summer autumn and winter um it's just beautiful so many different tones and i cannot wait to try this palette so guys that is everything that i picked up in the beauty bay sale and the be perfect 10 pound palette sale i really hope you enjoyed this video let me know down below if you have any favorites in this video um or if there's any products in it you would like to try if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you're notified every time i upload and i'll see you in my next one bye